All right. Here we go. We turn now to the data leak bombshell causing shockwaves across the world. The so-called ICA files. The disclosure of a... You win. So, what happens now? The ball's in your court, Miss Burnwood. I do have other candidates, you know. Most of whom have never tied me to a chair. You've seen the news. That was 47 acting on his own. He is untethered. He is unstoppable. And he cannot be bargained with. He will find you, Mr. Edwards. And I'm the only chance you've got. I'm listening. 47 has one weakness. Me. Wow, wow Diana. How could you do that? Continue the story, the farewell. Uh-oh. Oh no, big spoilers if you're just tuning in. Diana is turning her back on 47. something Buenos Aires International Airport this morning now watch this Harold trail ends at the airport but turns out that a top Providence operative owns a vineyard in the area Don Yates of infamous New York law firm Morgan Yates and Cohn and get this it's hosting his retirement party today she's infiltrated them She's sending a message. She needs my help. Could have fooled me. You don't know her. Anyway, if you're going after her, you'll need to deal with the Herald. Her name's Tamara Vidal, former CIA asset and political firebrand. She's a master of surveillance and the Constance's most trusted aide. She'll have eyes everywhere. You won't get far as long as she's in the game. Why are you telling me this? I thought you were out. Yeah. Old habits, I guess. Anyway, I... I need to go. See you around, 47. No, you won't. All right, so this is going to be good. I'm going, uh, I might bring, uh, the trank, trank gun, trank dirt, some people. Um, the crowbar has been paying off, so I'm probably going to do the crowbar. Um... Kind of looking to see what other goodies we could maybe bring here. Um, maybe a poison syringe. This is... Um, okay, let's do it. We'll see what happens. I'll bring it. And... Nothing unlocked. It doesn't. All right, that's it. This is it. Here we go. We gotta find some Diana sauce. At least we're out of that last level. That last level was like claustrophobic. You're in like a just like big old compound underground computer base thing and it was just tight security everywhere. This one hopefully not as bad. Because you're not an idiot. Let's just humor him. Yates likes his little games. Don't be long. 
You got my message. You'd never get caught on camera. Not unless you wanted to be seen. So what's the play? You're not the only one who's been busy, 47. I'm this close to becoming the next Constant. I'll be able to dismantle Providence from the inside. Only one man stands in my way. Don Yates. That weasel was the partner's legal counsel for years. He's the top candidate. But remove him from the playing field. It won't work. If Edward suspects... I will convince him you acted alone. Retaliation for Grey. Trust me, I know what I'm doing. The Herald, Tamara Vidal. She has eyes everywhere, and they're all fixed on you. The plan won't work unless we take her out. She never leaves my sight for long. Whatever your plan is, I'll help you if I can. You're sure about this? As sure as I'll ever be. Here, I got you an invitation, just like old times. Come find me when it's done. Good luck, 47. Does that mean you could technically blow Diana away? Do not eliminate Diana. <laughs> you can kill her, it looks like, so you could probably like drop a grenade and actually kill her. Oh, well. I can trank her if I wanted to. <laughs> Super loose here. If we fall, we're going to seem like such idiots. We won't fall. We just need to get the boot from the door. Ready, Pam? Three, two. Oh, cut, Neil. What's this asshole doing in my shot? I'm sure the gentleman didn't mean to, Pam. Isn't that right, mister? Hey, asshole! What the hell is wrong with you? Go away! Don't give him the satisfaction, Pam. He's clearly a jerk. Let's just go for a break. Unbelievable. Alright, that actually might lead to me getting a disguise, maybe? Hey, long time no see. I guess not. <laughs> 47's an asshole. It's Aaron, sir, fr from the firm. I came as quickly as I could. Yes, sir, I have the files. Sorry it took so long, but I had to access our remote server to print everything, and I, I couldn't get my VPN to... Right. Sorry, sir. I'll be right inside. Oh... No way. Hey, you! It goes in the green bin. We try to recycle around. Oh, my lord, is that Akira Cuckoo? I, I've always wanted to see one in the wild. Oh, Gretchen will be so jealous. Oh, shit. Ah! <laughs> that worked. Partner. You sure you don't got something on you? Nothing gets past me, you better tell me.
you. All good. Go on. Aaron Ford Jr. Don Yates is expecting me. Okay, right this way, Mr. Ford. I said nobody. Nobody? I mean, compared to some of the other power players at the party. Okay, let's hear it. What? You didn't even unpack yet? Christ, join the game, Aaron. I'll be back. Okay, I might have to wait for him to come back because I just placed that file. A bloody trail of carnage and destruction ending with the partners themselves and other entrants. Our superior, the new supreme head of Providence. Is giving her the keys to the kingdom. Is over. Now, does that seem right to you, friends? Yes. That should get their blood flowing. Mr. Edwards, Don Yates, I have received your letter. I merely called to express my regrets that you were not able to make it to the party. Rest assured that I will extend our new herald the warmest of welcomes. Mr. Yates, I have your files right here. About time. You can set up shop in the ground floor guest room. I'll be right with you. Secret level. Oh, yeah, there's sniper up here. Look at that. Cannonballs, which uh, can use those cannons out front. I think you need gunpowder, though. That sword, bronze sword. <laughs> of 
Gunpowder, there we go. We can do the cannons if uh, need be. I think he has to come back down in here. We'll see. before you believe your own eyes, darling? Or are you trying to scare the letters away? Just listen to this. I am making a new addition to the Herald team. Diana Burnwood, former ICA. Please consider her my representative. At your celebration, yours truly, Arthur Edwards. Yes, we've been over this, Dawn. Can you believe it? This is the woman who waged bloody war on Providence. She is involved in the deaths of countless heralds and operatives, including Ken, our friend Valentina. Has Edwards lost his faculties? This woman will surely be our downfall. This woman cleared his path to the top. Is it any wonder that he wants to keep her close? The partners? You don't think he... Immaterial, darling. Why don't we take a stroll? The air will do you good. Yes. I suppose you're right. We'll figure this out, Don. You and I, we always do. This isn't going away, my love. It falls on me as constant to protect Providence against all threats, even his bad decisions. So let's treat this like a court case. The say Burnwood is a material witness to the prosecution and you need to get rid of her. Walk me through your strategy. Best course of action is blackmail. I've called in one of the firm's junior partners to dig up some dirt. If Burnwood has a weakness, if not, then Corvo gets to earn his seven figures a year. Burnwood suffers an accident, convincing but not too convincing, and the blame falls on her rogue assassin with a whimsical M.O. That might fool the Herald, but not Edwards. He could even be using her to test your loyalty. Yes, that is the crunch. 
Perhaps we're looking at this the wrong way. Perhaps it is hmm. less about the and more about putting together just the right tool. What are you thinking? That helps you. I am sure they would agree to back your story with Edwards, if properly nudged. Uh, say, by a crackerjack trial lawyer with a knack for stirring monologue. This would even strengthen their fealty to your concept. Nothing commands loyalty like culpability. Yes, I like it. I like it profoundly. I will get right to work on my closing statement. Thank you, my love. I truly would be lost without you. And don't you forget it. This is pissing me off. Yeah, don't think that is fixable. All right, you're on the clock, Aaron. Dazzle me. What do we got on Burnwood? She's an orphan. Aaron's killed by one of our clients, Blue Seed Pharmaceuticals. The experience taught her to seek justice outside the system. Would you like me to go through her records? They're quite extensive. Well, somebody did their homework. No, just her involvement in the 1% killings. Starting with our clients. Details, please. The gorier, the better. Well, here's one that might interest you. Janus, a retired KGB spy master, is eliminated in his adopted hometown of Whittleton Creek, Vermont, along with his bodyguard former Secret Service agent. The methods in question are quite ingenious. Just take a look here. The Himapan Hotel, Bangkok. Renowned rock star Jordan Cross is assassinated along with Morgan Yates and Cohn's senior partner, Ken Morgan, Cross's legal representative. Oh, I'm terribly sorry, Mr. Yates. I don't suppose you'll want to see that. Nevertheless, I have the details right here. I see. Very useful, Aaron. Keep it coming. You were 
chunk of mud lie. We're talking deep deep. The whole place looked like a horror film. Of course, Gates came down and told them all sod in charge of the taxi. You know what? You'd think there was some kind of failsafe mechanism or early warning system in place. Yeah, you would, but you'd be wrong. If the pumps malfunction, the tanks overflow. That pretty much sums it up. So, pay attention to that pump flow. Unless you're in the market for an extra orifice. Nah. Lightning never strikes twice. We'll be fine. These fermentation tanks are accident prone. If the pump malfunctions, the tanks overflow. This has happened before, provoking an appearance from Don Yates. wings and flew away. I for you don't you think I would have flagged it if it didn't smoke? It's a seal. It's doing what you do best. Sealing! Hey Jesus Mio, what do you want from me? You know, I'm gonna cut you some slack because of the baby. But you might want to work on that attitude. I'm sorry. It's just All right, we're slowly working our way in here. 
kill box. Hatch. Need that screwdriver though. Okay, we're out of there. Holy crap. Oh, and then you put the power cell in here like this, and I bet you fry that dude coming down. I might go for it. I don't know if that he's going to be like that for a while, or... Yeah. 
If he goes down there, I'm going to hit it. Sweet Valentina, that someone took a giant piss all over her ancestral vineyard. Oh, my God. A lot of people died. A lot of people died. I electrocuted everyone in there. Oh, you could like... Do that, lock them in. Getting the hell out of here. We fried them. Alright, I'll see if there's... Is there any other story beats here? Well, we got him. That's, that's all that matters. Got a little sniper nest to check out. You sure they're up for this? I don't want to piss off someone who can take my head off from a thousand yards away. Gates wants us on high alert. We've been at this for months. Ever since the 1% killings began. Nothing's gonna happen. I know. But when you start thinking like that, that's when it does. Who are we on the lookout for anyway? Yates didn't say. Just a standby for a picture ID and a kill order. Fine. Don Yates has the snipers on high alert. They await a picture ID and kill order from the guards on the ground. Yates himself is clearly off limits, but Tamara Vidal is a different matter. I'll just practice my lip reading. Oh, 
crystal. All right, what's next? Wait, I got it. You balance an apple on your head. <laughs> Up your... Huh? Mm. Would you mind getting off your ass and checking that out? Hey, por qué no? <laughs> Up yours, Rico. <laughs> what? I am a student in my mind. There's nothing here. I ain't got time for this shit. You don't say. Que carajo. Why not shit like this? Hey, you ready? Hey, I know. I gotta reload. The whole mission scrubbed. And the checkpointing did not... It did, when I did all that sniper stuff, it did not even checkpoint. Apparently it did not want a checkpoint. And usually the checkpointing's pretty good. But I'll have to run back and do that now. Getting out of here. Try. I'm gonna try pulling off the sniper one again. Story mission. It's not like Assassin's Creed, -y, like when you're in the bushes and stuff. Um, and like you leave a body in the bushes, like they can still find it in the bushes. You move them. But at least it kind of saved the the mission. Description stuff like it must have skipped the first part. I guess we don't have to check the snipers now. It's just Just we can go right for the earpiece Camera. Over. Okay. Camera. Scan. 
again a practice target sending target ID over I see it standing by for kill order over hold on target just reappeared confirm kill order over How do you order the shot? Um, I don't know. Is there anything that says order shot? Where the shot? Take the shot. Target is that was down. weird. Over. Okay. We're gonna scan Tamara, and then the sniper's gonna take Tamara out, and mission complete. Just gotta get uh, up close a little bit. Falcon, we have a confirmed security threat. Well, this is no drill. Over. Except for our I don't have a clear side. shot. Reposition target into line of sight. Left. Over. I'm looking in your direction. Yeah? Let me know how that works out for you. Well, this is fun. Well, enjoying the party. A bit crowded for my taste. Mm-hmm. Have you been down to the gardens? It's remote. Quiet. You'd like it. Bring your friend. I might just do that. She could use a bit of downtime. If only it weren't for the muscle. They follow us everywhere, I'm afraid. Where there's a will, there's a way. Excuse me. Okay, so I thought it, it was I was thinking the wrong bodyguard my bad 
At least we got a checkpoint. I thought it was her bodyguard, not bodyguards across the map. That was my bad. So it says dispose. It was these guys, not that guy. Got lucky. Good, good save caught me there. Hello, sir. All right. How the hell am I going to get rid of those guys? They're not moving. Is there a... Fire alarm? Maybe? I don't know how I'm gonna move these guards out. This is weird. It's a weird mission here. Might have to just, just nothing above, nothing like that. Constructive criticism. You could use a mint. Unless I just pull a gun, pop, 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 and run out of here. I don't know how else we could uh, do this. Can you not? Uh, what if I. No. Yeah, that's... Might be guns a-blazing. I'll do one last look around. See if there's anything that can pull the... Pull the fire alarm or something, but... It's not looking like it. Hola, soldado. One of the most gifted surveillance specialists ever to graduate. Run one of our interrogation black sites. That's weird. How the hell do you get rid of those guards then without any detection? That's weird. Couple of old money scions, Ingra and Wonder if I could shoot through the the top here and just plug them, maybe? Okay, now they're all over the place. What? <laughs> I I just went up to the... Like, they were all frozen, right? And then when I went up top, they just all went their ways. 
I was going to open fire because I didn't know I was going to shoot them through the top of the ceiling, through the glass, but now they're doing their thing. That's, I don't know if the AI's been a little bit buggy or not. Hold on. Target just reappeared. Confirm kill order. Over. Jeez. Take the shot. Over. Come in. Target is down. Over. My God. Where did Diana go? Did anyone? S Dude, she got sniped, flew off the railing. She didn't like get sniped back. She flew off the railing and then it hid the body. What? <laughs> I will take that as a win and I did not need to take out any guards because the body flew off the damn map. Because I, I have I had a feeling like the guards would have opened fire on Diana because they were gonna be like, hey, there's a body here. But when I walked by I said take the shot, I might have to take a replay look at that. Um she flew off the railing the opposite way instead of going back. And my shotgun stuck in my body, Diana! What? <laughs> it's done. Diana! Now what? There's a shotgun now, stuck in my stomach. Heart. It's in my ribs, Diana. Edwards, you know how to find That him, was... Why Edwards finds you, 47. <laughs> he is untraceable, and he never lets you forget it. He is cocky. And that will be his downfall. What's the plan? Too many eyes. Meet me at the Olive Grove at sunset. One last tango, 47.